we're back. Yeah, welcome back to Two Gay Guys Play Super Mario RPG. We're fighting a turtle right off the front. Yep. Start, whatever, words. I'm human not English. Human words. 284. I'm totally a human being with thoughts, feelings, and such. Not a robot. Nope. Certified. Why would you even think that? God, you have so much fucking health. I know. Talk about that. Is, uh... Fuck, I don't know. I was gonna make a joke about hard drives and I couldn't figure out how to do it. <laughs> It's okay. Whatever. Dead turtles are dead. Moving on. <laughs> also, I like how Gino now just doesn't shoot out of his hand. It's just like his whole elbow, like, lifts. Yeah. Hey, Chubster. I want to take you out on a date. We can go to Buffalo Wild Wings together. Oh, uh, uh, can we? No. Just me and the turtle? Oh, sure. Yeah! <laughs> I mean, I, I like Buffalo Wild Wings, but... Let's see what this does to you guys. I'm just curious. Huh. You're more than curious. Oh! Mm. Not anything to speak of. All right. Yeah. Fine. I mean, he was cute. Yeah. All of his attacks are very cute. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm so confused. Do I fight him? Do I not? I mean, Bowser's standing right behind him, and he's giving me this look, and I can't tell if he's angry or horny. But that's just usual, so I don't know what to do. Oh boy, I don't know. I'm just gonna get hit by a shell. Fuck, Jesus Christ. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> There's our episode title Angry or Horny. <laughs> <laughs> it better be. You're the one that makes the titles. I do. This is on you now. Oh! It's Bowser's giant mouth. So this is the room that, uh. We fought Bowser in. Yep. Whoa. Okay. They are coming for you. I, they do that. Oh. <laughs> Angry or Horny. Okay. So many of them. Need, need to get Mallow back in here. Just to take out the giant mobs. Yeah. Yeah! Always good. Ow. I don't know, I think I put Gino in here just because, like, I t took Bowser out. Yeah. Which I can put him back in once we get through here. Alright. Yeah. These giant ass cannonballs that are bigger than my arm. But whatever, video games. And also that they deal, like, less damage than a frying pan. Yeah. I think, did I, did I, I think, I'm fairly, alright. I'm fairly certain I upgraded his weapons. I was gonna say, I'm not sure about him and his weapons and his, uh, armor. I don't know. I, I think I upgraded, I think I upgraded everybody. Like, I always upgrade everybody consistently, especially because, like, money's not an issue in this game. Yeah, good. Like... It's like Pokemon, after a certain point, it doesn't matter. Yeah, I'm just swimming in money and, uh, Alpha Sapphire. Just so much. Should really get back to that. I just started the Delta episode, I got a Mew. Oh, I need to do that today. Yeah, get your Mew, otherwise I'm gonna feel so bad with the only one with one. I've had that code for like a week. Yeah. Peach gets her, her an actual attack special. Psych bomb, I'm into it. Alright, five, three... Actually, that's really good. We'll take that. Yeah. Yeah! That was crush. Crush my dreams. My dreams of having sex with Bowser. <laughs> Who doesn't have those? Have shout out in the comments if you've never had a sexy thought about Bowser. And I will ridicule you. Maybe not publicly, but in my mind. But, but we will think of you as a liar. Yes. <laughs> Forever, your name will be replaced with liar in YouTube. <laughs> we have that power. We do. So you know. That'll happen. We have the power to do that, even though we don't have the power to fucking schedule videos. It's ridiculous. I don't understand Putting why. Putting you on blast, YouTube. <laughs> um, uh, how old are you? <laughs> <laughs> um, old enough for you to sleep with, I hope. That's true. Yeah. I don't remember. Let's try this one. Oh, that's one hit. That is uh, very inappropriate for a children's game. Snowy. <laughs> Not snowy. Shocker. And I don't think it would do damage. Oh. I don't remember how to critical with that one, but you did a thing. Thunderbolt it is. All right. That's fine, enemies, you assholes. They don't do a lot of damage. They don't. Nice. Like, and I think the idea is because you you've been using Bowser, they just run away. But I want the XP. Ah. So every little bit helps. You yeah. Know? And you get like prior to this, we've been getting like ten or fifteen per fight. Now we're getting like thirty to fifty. Oh. So but, what the hell, Mallow. <laughs> get your shit together. Jesus Christ. Once again. Okay. 
there's times that you can just like, and I don't know, I assume it's random, but just cycle through the whole whole fight with once agains by killing him in one hit. Oh, oh all right. he's just there's, ran at yeah, you. There's just a lot of enemies in this section. It's fine. Jesus, 282? What is I don't understand these numbers at all. Like, where are they coming from? They were called, despite flying, he doesn't take a lot of damage from a... Uh, that was not a terrible punch. <laughs> I know, it was Terra Punch. You oh. could be talking about Earth Punch, but... Yeah. There's not a lot of damage here, like, in general. Alright. Specials. No go, apparently. Yeah. Alright. I don't want Bowser in here, because he makes all of them so scared. So scared. It'd be better if, you know, it's just gonna terrify them, if instead of bringing you into the fight, and then dealing with, like, the four text boxes to be like, they're scared and ran away in the animation. If it's just like the enemies, like, on the field ran away before you even got close to them. Yeah, like, that would make way more sense. And I know, like, fucking Nino Kuni does that. Ah, oh, it's the best thing, like, in Lunar, it does that too, if your level is so high above theirs. Mm. Instead of the monsters charging towards you to start the battle, they just run away into a corner. Mm -hmm. I guess. Fear me. I'm, I know, like, I think it's Earthbound, you just auto-win when you pop into combat. I can't remember. They're like, this is not... You don't have to worry about this, guys. That's called respecting the player's time. Yeah! Alright! Ultra Flame! He is now... legal. Level 18. Yes. That's how you know. That is how you know. So is Mallow. Star Rain. Oh, that was fun. I'll try time for the stickiest of butt sex. <laughs> you can eat him afterwards. Just, like, get some candy in you. Get the okay. blood sugar up. <laughs> Just replenish. <laughs> Meanwhile, he's screaming. <laughs> Told you I'm big bone. <laughs> oh, just got double teamed. Ugh, this whole combat's just gonna be like... This whole episode is gonna be us fighting normal-ass enemies till we get to the next boss. Yeah. What? Ugh. What is it? I don't understand. Oh, it's gonna do nothing because you've got that thing on. So glad I, like... Like, between episodes, I, like, re-equipped everybody with accessories after looking up, like, what the fuck does this actually do? Yeah. After 20 years, what does this actually do? <laughs> like, the answer is, like, makes her immune to all status effects. Yeah. There like, we go. I'm like, great. Do that. That's yeah. fantastic. Smack the green off your face. I mean, that worked. And that attack up. Hells yeah. Yeah. The Forkies have come to the senses. I, I was quite disappointed. I was going to use that as a title. Aww. The Forkies have come, dot, 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 to their senses, but it didn't fit. I just do the Forkies have come. That's true. But now we already have Angry and Horny for this episode, so we're going to need to make that joke again. Thanks. <sighs> to be fair, this is like the third time we've made it, so I don't right. feel super bad. Like that movie? Ugh. The movie's so bad. Mm. Excuse you. What? Out of this apartment. No. Fine. Hey, Krako. Krako, more like, because he's got a drug addiction problem, but he doesn't want people knowing about it. Hey, buddy. Hey, Mario, did you remember to use the save point? There's plenty of danger up ahead, so it's best to save now. You need anything? I've got some items to sell that I inexplicably stole from other NPCs. Yeah, he's got all... If you didn't get the last set of, uh... Oh, good. Oh, I'm out of space. So, I don't <laughs> Oh. Okay. Well, then. You're useless. Really? Oh, because they're, they're, they're so not low. low. Yeah. I've had that since the, like, second episode. Well, you're gonna hold on to it until the last fight. Yep. It's like that. That crystalline. <laughs> I bought that in, like, the fifth episode. Into the darkness we go. All right. Um, there are six doors. Do you need an explanation? I know how doors work, but sure. <laughs> of the six doors, two open into action courses. You can handle a lot of action, right? Um, that's why I brought all these lube and condoms. <laughs> two others will lead you to battle courses. You can fight, right? Um, that's why I brought all these lube and condoms. Allows to open onto puzzle courses. No sweat for a great puzzle solver like you, right? 
Uh, inaccurate. I will get very nervous and very sweaty. Once you choose a course, there's no turning back. The only way to know what's behind a door is to walk through it. You must pass four of the six courses to move ahead. All we'll right. do that next time on Two Gay Guys Play. All right. Bye.